Um, oh no, I'm frozen again. Am I frozen? I'm frozen, but the, the game is fine. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, hmm. So I should be, oh, okay, there we go, I'm moving. I see myself moving now. I don't see my mouth moving, but. Ah, uh, 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 why is my mouth moving? It's supposed to be, it's supposed to be based on, on, uh, hold on, let me look at my settings. Yeah, it shouldn't, it shouldn't be this, things shouldn't be this fucked up. I don't know what's going on. Um, mouth, where's mouth? It has face tracking, so it should be using my mouth. Why is it not mouth mouthing? Uh, weird. Okay, let's try that again. Clicking on settings, uh, mouth, things, moving sensitivity. Yeah, sensitivity is way up there, so it should be moving fine. Um, but it's not. That's good. Um, uh, microphone, yes, good, good, we're good. Okay, my, uh, that, uh, all right, it's kind of working ish. Maybe I just reset, maybe just a reset will do. No, right, hold on, let me just, I'm gonna exit VC face and start it up again. The game should actually look paused, so that is normal. The game looking paused right now is totally normal. That is the one thing that looks fucked up that's not. <laughs> Um, okay, I think part of the, the fuck up was... Okay, there we go. Now I'm moving my mouth fine. Good. Okay, I think far, part of the fuck up was something... Firefox was doing something funny. I don't know what the fuck it was doing. Firefox was interfering. Um, it was using too much... Too much uh, processor, I guess, or something. Oh, shit. I just gotta turn down the... Turn down the volume. That's the only thing that's not correct. There we go. That should be less intrusive. Uh, I'll put it up a little more because this game, this game is quieter than most of the games I play. Um, goodness gracious! All right. So I finally figured out part part of the Edge of the World DLC. I say part of it. This. Um. What the fuck is the place I gotta go? Just let me. There we go. So I can finally correctly show this off, which is fun. Access to um, where is it? Shit, what was the place called again? It was Stargazer. There we go. Stargaze. This starts off one of the, one of the quest lines that I didn't do. One of the two that I didn't do. I still don't know why the other quest line doesn't appear, but hopefully it does after I finish this one or something. I don't know. Thirty years ago, we sent out an expedition to an area where. At least I think this is it. It should be because it says it ends at the Benthic, and when I looked it up, the Benthic is a place that's in that should be new to the DLC. Never found anything until now. Okay. A trailer blown off course. Slightly lowered again. I'm. I keep fucking with the settings. God. All right. We have a feeling that this course might indicate the wreck of that lost expedition. We've already sent a research vessel to examine the wreck and recover the original data for the expedition. We don't expect any security risks that far away from civilization, but nevertheless, we will rendezvous with our research vessel at the site and provide security. Our resources are already stretched. Resources, I like that. The, the way they say that. The resources. Countries. We expect discretion as part of this contract. And we will not commit any further resources. You are on your own. I have several other games I plan on playing after this as well. Um, one game that's an early access game that's not coming out for a couple weeks or so. But they said they don't care, you can just play it whenever, I guess. It's like, okay, cool. I, there's not much to spoil in it anyways. It's it's it's, uh, it's basically like a 3D snake game. You know, like the the old game Snake. It's 
basically a 3D version of that with some extra bits in it, I guess. No, they gave me a code, so I was like, alright, sure, I'll, I'll show it off on stream, why not? Benthic. Oh, it's a ship! Is this why I couldn't find it before? We don't have much stock on board, but I managed to get a few Falconeer supplies before we What's left. This? Is this a better, better version of mine? I'm gonna take it. Ooh, wait, hold on. Boom. Acid pot, what the hell? Nah, that's fine. Okay. We suspect it might have been survivors. Destroy the mines. So that's what I gotta do, okay. Boom. Please remove the air mines so we can investigate. Got it, boss. We'll destroy those mines. Ay -ay -ay. And I'm glad everything's working fucking perfectly again. Um, is that not all of them? Oh, there's one more. So I think it is, okay. Just looked over for a second, it looks like it's firing on my end from Streamlabs. Um... This one? Yeah? Alright. Okay. I think I noticed these missions with at least the first set of missions. They were all pretty quick. I was like, oh, I was kind of surprised. But based on the other DLC, it looks like that's normal. The, the extra missions seem to be super quick. This situation requires more from you, Falconeer, it seems. We will be depending on you to take on an unknown opponent. In lieu of this, we are giving you some background info. Somewhere within this vicinity lies the first Basilicus, a long-rumored first attempt at building a vault by our forebearers. We know it was abandoned during the War of Tears, and the Order had assumed it was worthless because of it. But it seems something oh. there is worth killing for. What the fuck? Worth keeping it out going off the map for real? <laughs> Instead of just of <laughs> going off the map for fun? I'm just I'm doing an actual mission? What the fuck? Alright, that makes me think that they have they do in fact have more DLC planned. Because I remember hearing that if you find they thought about it, but take him out. Um, do not hesitate. I remember something about like they were gonna make the map. The map was gonna be ever growing, um, which it has apparently, and that's why I got so confused trying to find this fucking DLC. Uh, but I guess they have they have more planned if they're they're actively telling you to go outside of the map and yeah. Am I too close to the mic? I think I'm too close to the mic. Let me spin it over a little bit. I see it's, it's it's getting close to peaking. Probably not very fun to hear in the ears. It's not not what they mean when they say peak performance. They don't want that. Welcome, Mansa. You took your sweet time getting here. I left your fellows rotting on their ship thirty years ago. Oh. Hold on. Where, where is this? Oh, what the hell? What? Hold on, what? Wait, what? I'm... What the... F Wait, what? Hold on, I'm confused. There's a train? Wait, hold on. Hold on, what is happening right now? What? Wait a minute. I'm fighting someone on a fucking train? What? I don't... Shit. Shit. Hold on. I was not prepared for this. Oh, fuck. Alright, hold on. What the... I was not... What the fuck? Alright. I, 
forgot to redo that that, that whole bit. My crew went through the wreckage. Okay. All right. Um. It what the? the ship... Okay. I was I not paying attention to mention anything about the train. What the fuck? I I've literally only fought ships and and other falconeer things. What the fuck? What the fuck in hell? I'm actually very confused at what the fuck was going on there. Um, all right. <laughs> what? Maybe that's why they made the mission so short, because they, they figured to be thrown off, you'd have to start over again. They didn't want you to have to go back to the beginning and go Welcome all the way through. On, <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, there we go. Okay, there's the ship. Uh, hold on. Oh god. Oh no. Oh, goodness. Okay. Um. Uh. Okay. Where? Okay, there it is. This is gonna be a little difficult to figure out how to fight this thing because I keep. Getting hit? Okay, what the f Come on, let me. Come on, where is it? Where is it? I thought it was coming out here. Shit. Uh. Can I go in here at all? Probably not now. Alright. Oh god, where, where are you coming from? Where is he shooting me from? Behind? What the fuck? Where, where, what the fuck? Hold on, where is my map? Okay, there we go. Come on, let me get the. Let me get the. the Oh come on! It, it, this is a, a problem with the, it's, it's, uh, the ship. The, the train is. Uh, did that do anything? Oh god, I'm almost dead. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh no! Is it too? Hold on. What the fuck? Why is it like? Now the voices are way loud. Um. Oh, there's you no. Know... A oh, voice line. There we go. So I'm noticing it's the voices are the same volume as me. Oh no, I, I pressed the wrong button. Fucking hell. Alright, uh oh. Uh, 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 there we go. Save. It's okay. Is it okay, that's a, a little better I guess? Alright. <laughs> but uh, oh god. <laughs> I don't want to, I don't want to taste this. Can I... Uh, is there something I'm missing here? I'm supposed to be doing? Because I can't, I can't really attack him when he's under there, right? Uh, okay. No, no, there they are. Uh, yeah, why don't we target when I'm, he's under the fucking thing? Okay, uh... I'm quiet, oh no! It says I'm, like, peeking, what the fuck? That's not good. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, hmm. It's more, more issues than I guess. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> I did move myself away from the mic, but that's because it, it's it's showing in the yellow right now when I'm talking. It's showing in the yellow, so I was like, oh, this is probably bad. Uh... Ow. Fuck. Ugh. Almost dead again. What the fuck? Uh. Fuck. 
This is actually like a really annoying fight. Holy crap, what? Neat in theory, but in practice, uh, not super fun, to be honest. I think he's repeating stuff. I think he's. I think he's saying like the same thing over and over again, isn't he? Or at least reiterating the same point every two seconds. <laughs> like what the hell? <laughs> um. Ow! What the fuck? Where the hell? Man, I should have bought that second fire pot so I can let off another one of those thingies. Oh god damn it! Um. Oh, there he is. All right. Ow. Ow. Let me, let me target you. Damn it. <laughs> I can't target him. There we go. There we go. Now I can target. Now, oh, this is bad though. Probably gonna get hit again. Come on. Oh. Oh, goodness. Oh my goodness. Can this guy, uh, chill? <laughs> Can this guy chill? Wait, where is the train? Am I behind it again? Is it, is it ahead of me? Where is it? Fucking hell. Um. Okay, there it is. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I can't seem to... No, don't hit me. Oh god. No. Uh, he's angry about the mancers and what they've done. Because in this chapter, I'm, I'm a mancer, and they're like, the mancers are um, what the hell are they exactly? They're like, they're the keepers of a great secret in this game, um, which is that they came from another world, and I don't exactly know. I can't remember what the fuck they were talking about at the end of the game. It was also confusing once it got towards the end. I don't think I kept up very well with uh, what was going on. Um, but for some reason, a lot of the people didn't like that the secret was being kept, and they were trying to overthrow the Empress, and they made a new Empress or something. Uh, but then at the very end of the game, the old Empress comes back to life, I guess? <laughs> because one of the sea enchant enchantresses brings her back. Yeah, I, there's... This game is very neat and has a lot of cool ideas, but the story, I feel, is a little uh, hard to follow. <laughs> like, I like the... The world is very interesting. And the fact that we're, like, apparently... I don't know, intruders on this world, but also made it our own, I don't know, it's, <laughs> it's got cool ideas, it's, it's neat, I like, I like, it's fun, it's very fun, but, except for this, this fight is not fun, it's, it's honestly, it's uh, a little, a little troublesome, oh god, okay, I can't go through there either, oh boy, oh no, oh no, 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 um, I guess I should try to go ahead of it somehow, I don't, Fuck. What did he fix? What did he find? I don't know what he's saying. He can't be talking about the world tree or whatever the fuck or anything, because that's not even near here. I don't know what he's talking about. I do that. <laughs> oh god. Eh! Eh! Shoot around. Come on. Almost. Okay. I did it. Holy fuck. Thank god. Okay, that fight was a little annoying. I, if I bought a second fire pot and used that, I probably could have destroyed it real quick, but... Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh god, oh god. Um, should I not be there? That giant explosion? Um, oh, is it just... It sunk. He sunk it. He died and sunk, whatever that was. Okay. That's, um, oh, oh my goodness, uh, okay. <laughs> Alright, um, I don't know what happened, but that guy was very upset. Was, this, this mission's about finding a lost 
treasure or something, I think. So I don't know if that was. Uh, I don't. I don't know. <laughs> uh, it's uh, yeah, it's him. Death. That's his death. That's his dead. Um. All right. Uh, what the fuck? I, don't, I. I honestly couldn't tell you what exactly was. What entirely went on during that? Just that. Um, that guy has probably lost his mind because he's been there alone for who knows how many years. Um, actually, no, he said like 30, right? Been there for like 30 years? Oh, shit. Oops, actually. Passed the text. The past can be a dangerous place to visit. Whatever that spy thought he'd learned was all filtered through his own limited perception on history. Personally, I feel the pain of all that is now lost to the waves. What we could have learned and saved is all lost. But from the perspective of the past, as the Mansa Order sees it, it is better to leave these relics to the deep. Our world still bears the scars of ages past. Yeah, sure. We will sure. remain here to bury the dead and clean out any remaining evidence. 15% accuracy. <laughs> oh god, that's not, that's, um... Things were left for a reason. That's I not entirely name. great. <laughs> oh, completed. We don't have much. I did it. I thought there was supposed to be like three missions. I thought each mini quest was three missions, not that was just two. Um, all right. C cool, I guess. All right. Um, I know there's another thing over here that I can do. I'm assuming it's also part of the DLC. I don't 100% know. Um, <laughs> I, it, like I said, it'd be so much easier for me to know if I I had An arbiter, I knew that I was supposed to. I knew that the game evolved over time. <laughs> I assume the DLC was like a separate like thing that would unlock or whatever, but it's just in the world. So I guess technically, if you bought the game and didn't buy the DLC, you would still see these new places. Um, you just wouldn't be able to do any of the missions and stuff, I guess. Which is like, no, isn't that? That's kind of accurate to like an MMO type game, right? They're, they're kind of like that. So I guess that's not. It's not all unfamiliar, but I don't know. I was confused. Though I, I, I do get confused quite often, <laughs> so I don't know <laughs> if I should be trusted very much. <laughs> oh god. Uh oh, okay. I think this and one of the fights I did during the other... Or maybe not, maybe this part of the... I don't know. I did another fight against the Legendary Ace that wasn't part of the main quest line. And I think that's like that was one of the things they talked about with the DLC. There's two new legendary aces. Um but that I, that guy wasn't very legendary, um just went down very quickly. Uh um now I just gotta deal with the rest of the the <laughs> people here, what the fuck? <laughs> uh it was actually probably the weakest ace I fought out of all of them. That was weird. Assuming I locked onto the right one. Maybe that wasn't the right one I locked onto, but. Thought I did. Oh, and that's it. And that's the mission. Okay. Yep. Kind of. I don't know how to judge this entirely. Well done. That was a Cause like, you did not need during these Star Fox came in so hard. Yeah, it's um. No, it's not terribly. Uh, once you get used to it, uh, it's not very difficult. But uh, it was kind of. Ooh, this is this bird is way better. Getting this bird. Uh, once you get used to it, it's kind of simple. Um, 
Star, yeah, Star Fox is another game. It's like I mentioned the other day. Uh, I found it similar to you know uh, again same thing, Panzer Dragoon, same type of thing. Uh, Rogue Squadron, uh, Ace Combat, even. All similar. I still don't know exactly how to get this last. Um, cause this right here is the other new place, but, um, last time I tried to go here, there wasn't anyone to give me a mission. But now that I've, now that I've done the other one, maybe he appears? I hope. Yeah? Oh, it's just, nope, okay, nope. Alright, so I don't know how to access this last mission set then, um... It's a little... Annoying, to be honest. I, I do like the game, and I would like to play more missions, um, but I don't have any idea how to get to it. I tried to look it up, and I could not find it. <laughs> um, that's yeah. I don't know. I assume I have. To, I had to be in the Mancer because it's it's a Mancer. Even place. Claim these um, I guess I could technically. Let me go back to the main menu and change chapters. I could technically try and go back in the first chapter, the since I'm not allied with anyone there. there. Um. Choose now what story is. But. I don't. I don't. I don't know. Yeah, um, leave, leave, leave. As far as I can tell, this is the. You're just supposed to start off the mission set over here, because like I saw a screenshot showing there's a guy here that you can talk to when you land. But every time I've tried, there's no one here. There's just the trader. That's it. So I don't. I don't understand. I'm not. <laughs> this is like a weird bug only I'm getting or something or it's not appearing or, or what uh, I mean I'm very sad about that um the most alright well I, I can do I can show off um my favorite mission the of which one was it at it's not one of the other places I forget which one it was um I think it's at this one Show off one of my uh, the missions that I, I did really like. It was really weird and neat. <laughs> Let me see here. Uh, here we go. This one. Our client has one final request. You will be interested to know that the Osuri was a source. So of I'm bringing a guy in a sarcophagus to a temple, uh, dropping him off to uh, to keep him there, I guess. <laughs> and like, you will be carrying the I don't know exactly what what the the cause is, but like some weird shit happens as you're trying to fly him there in the temple. <laughs> I thought it was really cool. Here, Ace Combat's really good. Um, I play. It's actually no. I did play some of Seven. I haven't. I haven't played it much. Um, I should get back. To, I should try and get back to that. I, I liked what I played of it, but um, yeah, Ace Combat's pretty good. Uh, I think there's been hit and misses throughout the series, but um, aside from this latest one, I, I've heard the best one is the Salt Horizon, which is not not one of the numbered ones. I think. Maybe um, uh, it's hard to find that one though, because that's that's old like was it PS3 360 era game, and it's no longer on Steam. I'm pretty sure. Um, I'm not entirely sure why, unless it's like a, it could be a um, licensing reason or something. I don't know exactly. I don't think it's on Steam anymore. Uh, or it could have been taken off and then put back on Steam. A lot of games do that quite uh, quite a lot. Uh, you have that one. Oh, that's good then. That's that, I hear that's the that's a really good one. I hear that was the best before set. Okay, see, this is the weird shit that happens. This thing, these things just like pop up. I don't. Um... Oh god. Oh, oh god. I can't... this mission you also can't really see. It's kind of uh, you're kind of in the dark a lot. It's a little difficult. 
to navigate. But uh, that's, I think that's some of the fun of this uh, this mission. See, like these weird bird statues appear and shoot things at me. Oh god! And I don't know why they appear or what, what what's going on with them or <laughs> what the fuck. But um, I wish there was more weird shit like that. Oh god! Oh my god! I almost died. One hit and almost dead. Holy shit! Um. Yeah, I have no idea what, why, why that's happening, and why I'm dropping him to the temple to, to either kill him or keep him here for all of eternity. Um, I'm not sure what's, <laughs> what the dealio is with this. Um, but it's so weird. I like it. I, I, I did like really weird shit all the time. It's my favorite. <laughs> My favorite things are the the weirdest shit that ever happens in games. Um, so that's why I really like that mission. I wish there was more weird stuff. Um, maybe the third mission set is th that weird too, but I, like I said, I can't figure out how to do it. <laughs> it is done. Here, and that's in full. sadly a, a huge issue. <laughs> like, because I'm pretty sure I've explored like everywhere. Every single place and done that. Yeah. Aside from, there are three fortified locations that I have not found, but I tried to look for a map and I've only found a map that was from before this update, so I don't know where those locations are. Um, there's this one location here that I thought was something, but when I go to it, nothing happens, so I don't know what that is. Um, This is one of the other DLCs. It's also kind of a neat mission. It's like a, a, a base is in the back of a turtle or something for pirates, and you, uh, you try to free the turtle. It's like a giant, giant fucking turtle. Uh, it's the only thing I can immediately think of is fucking uh, Aladdin and the 100 Thieves or whatever. What was, what was that movie? That's also a giant turtle. <laughs> That's what I compare it to. <laughs> um... I do like this game a lot, but there's this DLC was so it's so confusing to navigate and figure out. Like I said, part of that could just be um, me not playing the game until I got access to the DLC, which I probably should have waited. <laughs> I, I, I've had this game for like uh, months, and I just never I never played it. But then when I was offered to play the DLC, I was like, oh sure, yeah, let's let's do that. That sounds like fun. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, alright. But like I said, it's fun. It's good. Um, actually, the, the full game went down in price um, recently on oh, Steam, at least. Exactly it's enough. 20 bucks for just the base game. Uh, the DLC is like 8 bucks, I think. You get a slight discount for buying them both bundled, like 26 bucks, I think. It's, not a, it's actually not a really bad deal for this game. 15-ish um, hours, I think, of content fun stuff uh, I hope there's more DLCs um, if the, I hope as it comes out it'll be apparent to me that uh, that yeah it's it's my own fault for not figuring out for not uh, playing the game in the first place to notice all the new shit because the map before apparently didn't show like showed this kind of but then didn't show this around here showed here didn't show like what here or something something around here didn't show and then through here and then like I guess some places like popped up too it was weird I was looking at the map and I was so confused because it's because look at this this giant fucking thing and then this this whole bottom corner didn't exist and I was like what the fuck um, yeah. But that's 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 uh, that's the the DLC, I guess, because I can't I can't figure out how to access the last the last mission set. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. Um, if I if I ever figure out, I'll show it off for sure. I 
like I said, I enjoy it. <laughs> it's a, it's a game I I've uh, since I started playing, I keep wanting to come back to it. And I do want to still go back to it as the now, but like I got to figure that out. Actually, <laughs> this is one of the very few games that I've also 100%ed the achievements on on Steam. I, I was very uh, <laughs> very into that. Right into unlocking everything, getting all the Chivos.